that. So, all right. So, uh, I mean, I'm still drinking my coffee. I was going to take you guys outside, but I'll have to shut you down first. Um, I already talked about top dressing my plants, I think, because it's been too wet, too much rain. I think I said that in the other video. Too wet, too much rain. Um, um, so I can't put fertilized water into my plant. So I've got my dry stuff, the Gaia Green, um, and I can top dress it. The problem is it takes, you know, it starts seeping into the soil, but it takes a good couple of weeks and the plants are hungry now. So hopefully we're going to get some dry time and I can get this all settled before we go away too, before I go away. So, um, so there's that issue I'm dealing with. Sorry, I'm keep looking over the left. I'm just trying to look to see like while I'm telling you guys something like, okay, what else needs to be done? But that's pretty much it for battening down the hatches for here. And I'll just sit tight and uh, I'll download a couple of movies or something in case uh, I'm without internet for a bit. So I don't see us having power outages here. Not, not for heavy rain like that. It's possible if it gets really windy because a lot of the times these remnants from hurricanes, the wind comes with the rain. Although, I say that. Let's see what it's saying for tomorrow wind-wise. Special weather. It's still unclear as to actually where it's going to be hitting us, but it does seem like all the models are saying like eastern Ontario, which is where I am, unfortunately. This, this, uh, God, it's so hot down here. I can't stand it. I got to get back up north, man. Too old for this shit. Okay, the wind tomorrow is, uh, it's not even bad. It's just going to be a steady downpour of rain. Uh, 15 kilometers out of the northeast, and then uh, Thursday, 14 kilometers out of the south. So I'm not, you know, it's not like uh, it's going to be super windy or anything. The bus, of course, doesn't leak whatsoever. So it's fine. I've got all the windows shut in it. Like I had windows open just to let air in, but they're all shut now. Um, actually, I gotta go in and check the mouse traps because I'm catching mice in there. I mean, uh, they always will find a place to go. Hello, I'm coming in now. So I probably caught two. I already caught two, so it'll be a steady thing, and until uh, it's sold, anyways. Um, that's it. So, all right, well, please like, share, and subscribe. If you want to see more vol full videos, I'm on Rumble, which is rumble.com slash the letter C slash lad from the woods. YouTube, of course, youtube.com slash at symbol lad from the woods. Okay, those are my two addresses for the big, like regular, you know, those kind of videos like this way, like uh, whatever you call them. So 16 by 9 video. So I, I'm doing these separate now for TikTok and stuff because it just seems to make more sense. You know, because people aren't, like when you see the video goes on the TikTok when it's the landscape where 9 by, not 9 by 16, 16 by 9, it doesn't look right. So this is what people want. They also don't like long videos. So I'm going to probably have to break this up into like three minute increments or something. I don't know. Anyways, so the usual thing, if you want to support me and my work, uh, the la the, there's links down in the description, which is paypal.com slash lad from the woods, buy me a coffee.com slash lad from the woods. There's also an Amazon wish list for needs of the camp, the cats, all that stuff. So you've got all that there. But liking, sharing, subscribing, it's working, folks, because we keep getting more people. And I mean, I'm not going to be one of these channels with 40,000 users like uh, my fellow Canadian Lost Lakes or forestry forest way out there in British Columbia or the lovely one women's wilderness for obvious reasons they love her because well number one Miss Lizette is beautiful beautiful woman and her setup where she is off grid she's doing everything herself and what a job she does up there I'm just so impressed with her I'll tell you if I I, I, I Anyway, I have a crush on her. I'll just say that out there. So, Miss Lizette, if you ever see this, yes, I have a crush on you. And uh, um, it's there, I said it. Uh, we're both of the same mindset, you know, with the outdoors and off grid and all that. Um, for me, she's the perfect woman. So, I've never met or seen anybody like her until I started watching her channel. And she's from, well, she's, I, I know from her like 
postal address because you can mail 